is, uh, this is Jeff from Public Lab, and I wanted to show you um, the latest on the infogram.org website. Um, this site allows you to post-process the photographs you take with an infogram camera. Um, and uh, to read more about that, there are some links here. This front page is going to be revised pretty soon. Right now, it has this uh, upload feature, we've, which we've had for some months, and you can process things that way. What I want to show you is the, the new version, which we're going to be uh, rolling out as the, as the main version very shortly. You can already get to it through this link right here, Infogram Sandbox. Infogram Sandbox is a completely web-based uh, editing suite. So what you can do is you can select an image, just like in the old one. You can manipulate it here and, and try different things out on it. What I wanted to show you today um, were, were, were a few new features. The first is this WebGL uh, feature. This is by um, uh, Piotr Foltine, who uh, began contributing to the project recently. If you have a fairly recent browser, you can click it, and everything will just sort of run much faster. It runs on your graphics card, so it's really nice. Otherwise, it's identical. The second is this Activate Webcam button. And I just pressed it, and now it wants to use your camera. I don't actually have an Infogram camera plugged in right now, a webcam. But uh, I'm going to demo it just using the built-in camera of the computer. So this won't be real photosynthesis analysis, but it's just to show you how it works. If you press Allow, you'll see me. Uh, you can take a snapshot and it will freeze it, or you can actually press, and this is exciting, live video, and it will show you a live uh, readout, uh, which in this case is just me narrating this video. Um, and, um, and what you can do is um, you can apply these uh, infogrammer expressions directly to the live video, and it runs fast enough to, to do that. So if you click NDVI, which is normal, Normalized Difference Vegetation Index, the sort of standard way to assess photosynthesis in an infogram photo. You get that. It shows you a scale. You can colorize it. It does that in real time. So, I mean, I'm, I'm still here narrating the video. Um, and, uh, and then you can do all of your infogrammer, uh, if you've read about that so far, um, where you, uh, you, know, you enter an expression and it runs the expression live, any, any expression live on the video. That's a pretty gnarly one. Uh, you can even do this and it will um, it will show you that, and you can kind of you know, play around with it and explore new things. Um, and then you can download it. So you hit download, and it pops that up. Um, the um, uh, last thing is you're soon going to be able to save it as well, and then it will be stored for other people to see, and you'll be able to share your, your data online here. So that's about it. Thank you very much, and uh, have fun infogramming.